First of all, it could be question if religion is really uh, fades away or if just traditional forms of uh, religious affiliation, church attendance, mass attendance is, is uh, in a way declining while people are still religious to some extent, maybe in a, in a non-traditional uh, way. But as I said, one of the problems people have and indisputable have with, let's say, traditional religion is that they think um, religious beliefs or holding a religious beliefs is counterintuitive or even contradictory, in, incompatible with the kind of beliefs and belief justificatory mechanism we normally hold uh, for true in, in, in normal life. Let's see the political evidences we have, the scientific methods of inquiry, let's see the whole fallibilism uh, we are used to in our life seems to be incompatible uh, with the firmness and certainty of religious beliefs. And I think a good philosophy can mediate with that. And of course, you cannot, in a way, heal the existential doubt of a person who, who believes or is not able to believe anymore by philosophical reasoning. But giving a good picture, telling, for example, a teacher who is in charge of religious education in school, giving him training so that he can tell the students there is no necessary contradiction, let's say, between the findings of modern science on the one hand and religious beliefs on the other hand. That can help in the long run. So my um, hope would be that this trickle down, so to speak, in every culture and can at least avoid to, to broaden the gap between, let's say, science and empiricism on the one hand and religious belief on the other. And that also is connected to the question of violence of religion. I mean, there might be something like a fundamentalistic uh, temptation to be violent, but why is that so? Because people who have religious beliefs have the impression that they need to protect their religious identity against modernity, which seems to be hostile towards a religious identity. And if you can make the case from a philosophical point of view that there is no necessary contradiction, no necessary hostility between, let's say, philosophy and science on the one hand, and religious beliefs on the other hand, that might help to ease this tension.